ISTQB Foundation Level Question 32 Which of the following statement describes a valid test objective? A. To prove that all possible bugs are found. B. Prioritize defect reports and insist to include those into the release. C. Reducing the level of risk of inadequate software quality. D. Run a full regression test pack before each release. Please press pause to choose your own answer before you see the correct answer on the screen. Correct answer is C. Reducing the level of risk of inadequate software quality. According to ICQB syllabus. We will see the exact quotes for this a little later. All the rest of the answers are wrong. Answer A. To prove that all possible bugs are found is totally wrong because this statement contradiction to testing principle 2. Exhaustive testing is impossible. We can never prove that all possible bugs are found. And of course, this statement doesn't rely to test objective. Notice. Avoid answer with proof here. Answer B. Prioritize defect reports and insist to include those into the release is a good idea, but this is not a valid test objective. Yes, it is important to prioritize and manage defect reports, but this is a management activity. Answer D. Run a full regression test pack before each release also is a good idea. But I would say that regression testing is support test objectives, way to achieve test objectives, but not a valid test objective in itself. My recommendation. Don't mix test objectives, testing principles and regression testing terms. Explanation. Molder. Let's look at the section 1.1.1 test objectives in the ICQB syllabus, where we can see that the false point is reducing the level of risk of inadequate software quality. And this is fully consistent with the correct answer C. I'll repeat my idea. Don't confuse test objectives, testing principles, and regression testing. Figure out with these terms and the ISTQB foundation level exam will be ridiculously easy for you. I believe in your hard working and diligence. Never give up.